Hi guys, in today's video, I'll be telling you on how to write an amazing cover letter that will help you to get into one of the top universities in the UK. It is because a lot of universities in the UK now require cover letters um, during your application for the uni. So with this amazing cover letter, um, it will help you to get into one of the top universities that you've been dreaming of entering. My name is Mavis and I've been living in the UK for the past 10 to 11 years and I'm on this mission to help students um, like yourselves either from Malaysia or anywhere else in the world that is coming to the UK to study and hopefully when you make your decision to come over to the UK to study um, most of my videos of about tips and tricks about living in the UK will definitely help. Let's get started. When it comes to writing an excellent cover letter uh, you would want something that would definitely capture the attention of the person reading it as this cover letter is sort of like a CV or um, it helps to give the reader an impression of you through words. Building that relationship while the reader reads through your cover letter is definitely quite important. You have to remember that there's a lot of students that have all the same stories with you. Um, they would like to enter the uni because of um, you know they've got good grades and they're really interested in this in this um, in this subject. What will make you different will be your experience and the way you tell your story to the reader. There are three things that you need to speak about yourself when you're writing the cover letter. Um, prominently will be something about your past, and your present, and then what you would like to do in the future. In the first part of the cover letter, mention why you are interested in studying in that course. So tell them how you've, um, what path have you walked on that leads you to choosing this um, course to study for your future. Make the story a little bit more personal. For example, if you're trying to get into a course for engineering, connect your story up to a personal level. and This should give the reader a little bit more insight into why they should choose you to study in their uni, to study in their school. You can also mention in your cover letter that what are the future job roles that you can get um, that this course entails and how does this job role helps with the future. An example would be how does a job would help the future of the world. If you're studying engineering, you could say that your knowledge will help to build a better machine. You can say that it will help to build a better machine that would generate less carbon into the atmosphere, for example. For the next part of the cover letter, that's when you can do a short introduction of yourself. So if you mention what you're currently studying in college and how does that subject that you're learning in college would help you in your future um, course. Just say if you're studying A levels now and um, the course that you want to take will be engineering. Um, so physics will be one of the most important subjects that you're currently learning in that you're currently learning in um, in college. And this would definitely help when it comes to engineering because I'm, I'm pretty sure that there's a lot of physics that'll be included um, while you're doing your job. When discussing about the extracurricular activities that you might have carried out either in high school or in college, um, you can always mention um, the ones that you've participated and how does taking part in them would help in improving yourself. So basically when it comes to writing your cover letter, it's definitely you would have to, it plays a better part if you know how to compliment yourself well, well enough to know that you are good at what you're doing. And not sell yourself and not sell yourself short, but not to sound very braggish as well. Yes, I know cover letters are quite hard, but it is what it is. Now, in the last part, this one you can mention sort of like the things you do during your free time, but always tie back to the course that you are trying to apply. So just say during the free time you like to watch, perhaps documentaries about the machines or about physics um, and then you can mention like how this you've whatever you're learning through that documentary the knowledge that you gain while going through the documentaries uh, could be applied back into the course that you're studying hence showing that you are really passionate about the course perhaps if you have someone who had um, the previous experience that you like to follow mention them in the cover letter as well as this would definitely help as this brings on to another personal level into your cover letter. 
So hopefully my tips will be quite helpful for you guys. And if you'd like to know how I would know all these t tips to write in a cover letter, it's because I have a um, it's because I have a template that was written by my brother and he has used that cover letter and he managed to get into one of the top universities in the UK. So if you'd like to have a free template, you can check it in my, the description down below. It will be there and um, the link will be there to download your free template. If you have any other questions, please feel free to leave them in the comment section below. I'll be happy to help. Until then, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!